Hey, what's up, good people? How you doing? Welcome back to Stock Up with Larry Jones. Go ahead and hit that like, subscribe, and the notification bell. It's a beautiful, uh, sunny Saturday here in the Midwest. We had snow on the ground yesterday, and then by Tuesday, it'll be sunny. It's crazy. Give it a minute, it'll change. But listen, I wasn't gonna make a video today, but I'm here at the car wash, right? And I pull up beside that car that's similar to this car. And um, um, she comes here often to get her car clean, and I do too. And I just, she said, nice car. I said, nice car. And I asked her, what does she do? And you guys know I've been talking about side hustles, right? So her name is? Mo. Mo what? Shopeju. Okay. So so scoot on in a little bit, a, a little bit more. All right. So I want you, the camera's right there. I want you to tell people what you do. So, um, hi everyone, I am Mo, like I said. So I have a nine to five. I am an IT project manager. Speak up but, a little bit. Okay, yep. so um, I'm an IT project manager. Um, I manage projects, but that's not what we're here to talk about. So as he said, I was here getting my car washed and we have the same car and a nice car is like nice car too. And we started talking about the car. But what I do on the side is car rentals. So I told him I have five cars that I rent out. One of them is the car wait, that wait, I brought wait, here wait, to wait, wash. Wait, 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 wait. Let me cut this car off. You got five cars that you rent out while you're doing your job. Absolutely. What service do you use? So I use an app that's called Turo. That's what I use. So it's kind of like an Airbnb for cars. Right, right. For those of you that don't know, I know a lot of you guys go, yeah, I know about Turo, but a lot of people don't. So now I, I just want you to just talk about gross numbers. Now you work your own job, mm -hmm. but about monthly, how much roughly do those five cars bring you in? So uh, those five cars in a bad month, I would say about six, seven K. About seven K in a bad month. About seven K. <laughs> what do you do in a, about how much do they do in a good month? In a good month, it's it's limited. Even just one car can do that that amount in a good month. Because I have different ranges of cars. So so what's um, been your best what month, you, roughly? Uh, Roughly, my best month has been about, I would say about 12K. Say that a little louder so they can hear you. <laughs> about 12K, yes. A, in a a, about 12K. Now, so we can help people because I want to really help people. And this is what I do. I try to inspire people to start these side hustles. How did you accumulate five cars? Yeah, and that is a great question. So I started with one car. I had just one car that was my baby. And that was it for me. And then the pandemic came, the car was there. I wasn't going out as much. And then I found out about Turo. So I listed that one car and right there, that same day someone booked it, it started to move. Then I started to um, increase my prices, just being competitive, right? Looking at the market, looking at what was available. So I had one car and someone came and took the car for a long time. It was almost about three weeks and I didn't have another car. So I had to get around and then instead of going to rent, I was like, mm, why don't I just get another car? Something not so fancy, but that I can use to do, I mean, just go around town while mm -hmm. the other car was away. So I went and I got another car. Did, was it a new car, a used car? It was a used car. I just went and got a Toyota Highlander, nothing fancy. Okay. Uh, that and was the, sec the second car. And then you, you just got a note on it or did you? Yeah, just... I did. I put zero down. I just drove up to the dealership, zero down, the ran, ran my credits, and that was it. I was out. I didn't have to pay no money. I just drove it out of the dealership. So, see, this is what I'm saying. If you don't have, this is what I love about this. Mo, you are, you are an example of what we talk about. So, you didn't put any money down, and you had a note, but even though you had a car note on that car, you were making money and you were making more than the car note. So Absolutely. let's say the second car note, how much was the second car note? So my second car note was about 300 and something. But how much, much were you making a month from the car? From that car, that car would do from 1200 to 1800 to 2K, just depends. Okay, so you, you was clearing about 900. Even though you had a note, you were still clearing. Right. Yes, correct. And and so this is some of the things that we we need to think about for those of you that don't have a lot of finances. Sometimes it's that's what I call good debt. 
right? Mm -hmm. So yes. we know a car is a depreciating asset, right? Mm -hmm. uh, 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 but if that car is making you money, it doesn't matter. True, it, that's the point. It, that's the point of it. I mean, the point is to make more than you owe on the car. So if my car note is 300 and something, I look about um, oil change and all that, even if all that, my debt is about $500 a month, I just need to make more than $500 and I'm good. So if I make 1200 that month, I, that's 700 that I didn't have the month before after all of the expenses. So that's just kind of like how it works. Wow. So you had a plan that worked, you rinse and repeat it. Mm -hmm. And instead of one car, you, you saw that you were limited by one car. So instead of just saying, oh, I quit, well, I've made it. Mm -hmm. You said, hey, I did it before. Let me do it again. Yes. And then again, mm -hmm. and then again, mm -hmm. and then again. Yes. So yes. are you planning on buying more cars? Is it more competitive to do that now? I do. I want to I want to buy more cars. It's one of my goals for 2024 is to expand the business. Just keep um, keep growing, keep scaling it up. Again, the, 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 the structure is the same. If I'm able to make more than it costs me to own that car a month, that's a good business. That's a good um, deal. But that's my mindset. Yeah. Well, Mo, I encourage you to start a YouTube page is what I, I <laughs> encourage you to do. Or somewhere on social media, I would say YouTube and help other people find their passion and monetize it. Help other people monetize it. So, you know, Mo, I always say on the show here, everybody chases what they're passionate about and that's True. not the best thing to do. Mm -hmm. The best thing to do is to find out what other people will pay you for mm -hmm. and become passionate mm -hmm. about it. And so that's what you did. Mm -hmm. You, I, I, I can guarantee you 10 years ago, you weren't thinking about Toro. Oh, no. No, mm -mm, no, yeah. not even five years ago, because I, I heard about this in 20, 2021, 2020 ish. Mm -hmm. It was just in the middle of the pandemic. That was when I heard about Turo. And I was like, mm, what's that? And I just tried it, really. And I tell people or I tell my friends, just try it. Download the app. If you have one car that you don't really use every day, even if you use it two days a week or you use it four days a week, that's three days that a car could make you money in a week. So those three days, go in and list it and you never can tell. Just start it. That's the key. Start it. One last thing. What gave you the courage to start it? I know 2020 was what made me launch this YouTube page, right? Mm -hmm. What was it that gave you the courage? You had your job. What was it that gave you the courage to buy your first car? It was, um, so as I said, I had my first car. It was my personal car. Ah, that was what I was using. Gotcha. But the pandemic came and that's what gave me the courage. I wasn't using a car. I had a car note on it, right? So I was going to pay car notes on it every month regardless. Um, the car was just sitting in the garage. I had a, 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 a almost brand new car with very low miles and was depreciating year on year because that's what car does, cars do. Whether you drive them or not, they are going to depreciate regardless. So the yeah. car was depreciating, just sitting in the garage. Instead of doing that, I had it making money for me. And that's how I started. That is great. Hey, listen, this was unexpected. Uh, we didn't expect <laughs> this. But again, I'm encouraging you to do something and take people on that journey with you. You know what? I'm going to invite you to the, well, we talked about it. I'm going to invite you to be on my show again. Okay. And um, uh, this was great. It's going to help a lot of people. That's what Stock Up with Larry Jones is all about. Hey, guys, if you need uh, some services that's going to help you in the trading area, make sure you check out the links below. We got Weeble there. I'm sorry. We got Moo Moo there. I'm Moo Moo there. And I want you guys to take advantage of 8.1%. And of course, we have the class Stock Up You. Listen, that is a $1,000 class. And as we add more to it, it will be $1,000. But right now, it's more than 50% off. Uh, anything else you want to say to people about getting started? Uh, just, just, you know, like Nike, just do it. Just do it, really. Just go ahead I, I mean i don't see a reason why not like i said if you have a car it's easy download the app in like what one minute okay. put in your details get started i mean sign up and just get started you literally go through the old enrollment process in about 30 minutes and that's it. you can do it while watching tv or watching your favorite game in fact there you go all right so the people are going to want to know i can hear them asking is she going to start a page are you going to start a page <laughs>
Are you think? Have you been thinking about that? <laughs> so, <laughs> I, I, I mean, now that you mention it, maybe I'll think a little harder. I'm okay. not so much of a social media. Pro I'm kind of like quiet or just inside, not really outside. But yeah, yeah it, it's possible. But you know what? People come to YouTube for knowledge, to learn something. So That's it doesn't true. matter. As long That's as you true. give them good information, mm -hmm. it doesn't matter. And be yourself, right? Absolutely. I like the fact that you still work in your job. And you have a actually a thriving business going on the side. I try. All right? And so, good people. I've been talking about starting a side hustle and investing it all, right? And just do that uh, uh, for a while. You notice she's still at her job, mm -hmm. right? She's still at her job. And that's what I'm saying. Don't get comfortable too soon, too quick. Work your regular job. Use that to pay your bills. But then start a, start a side hustle but send that money to work. Thanks so much, Mo. It was a pleasure meeting you. Same Good here. people, leave me a comment if you, uh, if you want Mo to start her own <laughs> YouTube page, <laughs> all right? I want you guys to leave me a comment. Make sure you check out the links below. Live, love, laugh, and learn.